Good morning. Well, today is 10 11. I think that that's a good number to look at. I see it often. I see the 8 11s, um, the 3 11s, the 4 11s. I see the sequences. I also see um, the um, 4 4 4s, which um, Kamoi Knight at uh, For Your Inner Voice discusses often. She loves the 4s. Um, I often see the five, five, fives, but I'm on this morning to just um, remind you guys of our Capricorn class next Wednesday, the 16th at five o'clock Pacific. It is $35, and if you want to get in on the Mercury retrograde class, it's going to be um, uh, 35 as well. The Mercury retrograde class, you get a gift. I have gemstones to um, help um, through um, the retrograde that we are in. And we know if we discuss the intensity of the last past couple of days, the emotions that could come up. However, with that being said, um, I want to just tell you how to pay for the class. You can go to um, dollar sign IFW Builders and um, make the donation for both classes at $60. And that's for next week. Both are at 5 o'clock Pacific. You'll put um, your information in um, the notes part for um, Cash App. And then also for PayPal, you'll put your information in. Um, and then I'll know um, how to um, correspond with you and that you made your payment. It doesn't matter who it is, just that you make your payment and I will be able to get back with you because you'll give your email address, but even your PayPal information leads to your phone number and cash app as well, so you won't lose your money. Now, with the energies that we've been feeling and um, I've been writing a lot because Scorpio causes you to go deep and to search. And so with um, the Scorpio energy in Libra, um, it can cause us to think differently than what our circumstances is as in love and partnerships, um, partnerships in our workplaces. The Scorpio energy can have us feeling um, and thinking deceptive because emotions are coming up whenever Scorpio come, comes around. Um, and it is emotions that we need to deal with. It's uh, e emotions that we haven't dealt with. You know, like last year when Libra was in Scorpio, I didn't have as um, intense emotions as I do right now. But because there's a readdressing of some things that had to do with last year, um, Libra and Scorpio, around September, October, or so, um, what's happening is, is that the purge is asking us to really let it go because we'll begin to respond to people in the negative. And so retrograde um, uh, mercury causes our communication to be, um, you know, stifled and stumbled. So with the class, I'm going to um, give information as I've given right now um, that's going to help us navigate through it, understand the energies better, and then also look at um, a scripture like I wrote on Facebook this morning. And I wrote, I write pretty much every day unless I'm not, you know, feeling a word or so. And the scripture was in Proverbs, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. So we have the power which I have on my t-shirt this morning. I am a woman of power to change our thoughts, which change our feelings. And so um, today at 12 also, we're gonna be doing a drawing for the t-shirts. There was few comments, but I do know that there were a couple of people that made comments and I believe they shared if they didn't. Um, I'm still gonna add names into um, our little box and I'll be with some of the other women that I work with um, so that we can kind of like just add the power of the feminine energy because that's where we're coming into. 
um, all of these planets that are uh, that have come out of retrograde and they're the, the mighty powerful planets um, Saturn Pluto um, Jupiter and um, so on and Mars is in there um, that they're asking us to reevaluate some things and actually change because there's a lot of us that are coming up into um, a new um, decade as game changers and when you are called to be a game changer that means that you're going to do mighty things if you yield to your potential so the reason why i i come on and you know i do videos is to empower people empower men and women because men and women have feminine um energy as well as um the, the male energy we have both one is lesser in the woman and one is lesser in the man and so um, in our weaknesses we learn to become strengthened if we look at um, life holistically which is why I bring forth Christianity's biblical aspect with astrology and um, um, uh, all the other aspects that I talk about energy that kind of thing um, because I believe that people have been you know navigated away from understanding energy and we are created out of energy and so if we are not understanding energy then we won't understand ourselves power is given away even emotionally if we don't know why we're um, overstimulated um, then we will react and it will be someone else's fault. We are always in our power until we blame someone else. So today, um, take today and say, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. Do I feel powerful? Maybe not. Yet, maybe yes but if I don't feel powerful then maybe I need to exercise eat better so that I can get the power energy within my body up because the highs and the lows is what cause us to have the emotions not to mention that we have to visit disappointments that happened in the past or yesterday that traumatized us we have to visit it embrace it and say it was part of my journey all right so um i know that that's a lot but if you get in on my classes or even individual um um coaching then you will get to understand this at a greater level where it will impact your life you know i've worked with a lot of um individuals and there's been changes in their lives and that's what i look forward to because the same um information that i give to people is the information that i had to birth myself i had to walk through um the utter darkness to get to the place where i am and there are days when i feel like i can't go on even right now but i know the formula get up kim get moving motivate yourself like david did in the bible and stimulate yourself you know that you have something in you that makes things happen so make you happen amen all right so i'll see you at 12 and um yeah the sun is shining here it's um not as warm today i think the cold weather has come in um to las vegas so anyway i love you guys and um blessings have a great day on 10 11 and look for the media showers by the way huh.